hey what's up guys hope you guys are doing good so if you have seen my previous video I had purchased the jet tech case for the iPad Air and I was overall I was pretty satisfied because it is a budget version of the Apple smart case and it did provide protection there were some flaws which I discussed in the video so if you haven't checked out that video make sure you do so when this video I'm going over the jet tech case for the iPad Pro 11 inch 2020 now this is a budget case for the iPad so if you're looking for an alternative to the one Apple offers I would go for this one and it has the same features as I had discussed in my previous video so it has the auto on off feature so if the top of the case is on the screen and your screen is covered your iPad automatically turns off and then if you open the case your iPad turns on the screen actually turns on now getting the iPad in the case was not much of a hassle but I have to admit if you ever need to remove the iPad from the case it is a struggle so you would really really have to struggle to get it out which means it's a really secure fit so if you look around the edges it's closed completely the only part that's not closed or covered is the part where you would place your Apple pencil so they conveniently left that out now the case is a perfect fit so the cutouts are perfect for your iPad if you look around the camera it fits perfectly so I don't have any complaints there now it is a very slim and lightweight case so it does not add a lot of bulk to your iPad so if you're looking for something that has a slim design and it's not heavy then this is the case to go for it also allows you to use your iPad case in view mode where you can stand up your iPad so there's several ways you can use this case now I do have the same complaint I had with their other cases so the material that covers the top of the screen the outside is nice and soft but the inside feels pretty cheap so you can see where they try to save money on which is the front and on the back this is just a personal preference I do not like the see-through part of it so when you have this case on it's not completely black on the back side so it's something you should be aware of if you do purchase this case here's a quick demonstration of the struggle you have if you want to remove the case from the iPad So that's it for today's video guys if you're interested in purchasing this case i'll leave the affiliate link in the description box below if this video has helped you out don't forget to hit the like button if you haven't already subscribe and until next time see you guys